I-35 equipment.com. There's a Hitachi 160-6 hydraulic track excavator. We welcome you to come look it over for yourself. You can bring your mechanic and operator or hire some local ones to come if you like. We are open by appointment only though, so just give us a call to get on the calendar. We'd be happy to meet you. Phone number here is 405-833-6437. If you'd like a hauling quote, we do send equipment all over the country, so again, it's up to you. Shouldn't be an issue at all. Just go for our website, contact or email with your full delivery address. We'll share that address, several local haulers, and H.Y. Broker. The very best friend to come back to us. We do welcome you to arrange for your own hauling or come pick it up for yourself if you're so equipped. Our specialty here is consignment sales. We have folks all the country. about our consignment service on our website or give us a call. This machine is a legal load. The hydraulic thumb is super nice to have for loading, uh, loading trucks with boulders, pulling some trees, sorting scrap, all sorts of things. Good digging power. Sounds to be running and operating excellent. Like I said, though, welcome you to uh, bring your own mechanic out or hire a local one so you can get professional opinion. This machine does have switchable control patterns, so no matter who's in the operator seat, they can be right at home with the control pattern of their choice. Cold working air conditioning does have the removable factory rubber floor mat for cleaning and the uh, factory seat with a seat cover over it. brush piles around show you one of the main benefits of having a hydraulic thumb and the good power of the machine there's some really big uh, oak trees Let's see I'm sure you'll get a good bite for you here in a minute be great for loading off-road dump truck or just moving piles around if you need a sort so you can start a fire If you're not familiar, this is the uh, twin to a John Deere 160 excavator, built on the same assembly line. Let him get parked and then we'll take a look at the motor inside all the access panels, then we'll end up in the operator station. You see that bucket does have the weld on cutting edge. If you're interested, we do have other buckets available. That hydraulic thumb does have the straight edge to help get you a better grab on whatever it is you're trying to load or pull on. The bucket does have the rear hoop on, you should hook up a chain to it for loading and moving stuff around.
different position than what it currently is, but see it's full and it looks pretty clean. It's good in here. It's nice and dry. Battery switch, but here's your battery control switch. You change how the uh, joysticks what they operate. Go ahead and zoom out to that fish eye lens to give you a good view of the interior up here. factory rubber format in case you want to remove it to clean. I'm going to turn the radio off. Factory seat is underneath that seat cover. I'm going to shut this door to keep some AC in here. Working horn. Uh, if I remember correctly, the hydraulic thumb is hooked up to the foot pedal. Yep. Currently seeing at only 48, 11 hours. Kind of hard to see it's bright, I know, but uh, re working rear view camera. Uh, it's good. AC wasn't turned up down all the way. Go ahead and turn it down all the way. And then, what else can I show you? Um, radio controls are just going to be this button here. You see that comes on. Dual travel speeds, work lights. Appreciate you taking time to watch. Hope this video is beneficial to you. As always, you see our phone update inventory of equipment online at wjj.i35equipment.com. Have a great day.